Hi everybody, Robin here at Toadstool Tarot, back again, welcome. If you like this or any of my other videos on the channel, please click the like button and subscribe. Um, this is the second of three decks of playing cards that I recently ordered on Amazon from a company called Flan's Gift. And this one in particular may bring out the adolescent in all of us because it reminds me of some goofy looking um, collectible cards um, that I had in my teens. Along with baseball cards, they had a lot of sort of uh, bubblegum card collectible series and one of them i think was these sort of crazy goofy looking monsters and i don't know if this is from those images but it's very reminiscent of them and i saw it and i thought oh that's fun and it brings back memories and i think i have to have that and uh some of them are sort of reminiscent of if if any of you know uh, or recall Ed Big Daddy Roth, who designed the famous uh, Rat Fink imagery and figures in the 60s. And uh, I think maybe it was Re Revell uh, brand put out these plastic models that you could put together initially with cars and then with monsters driving hot wheels or whatever and hot rods and you'd glue them together you know pun punch them apart from their forms and glue them together and then paint them with testers enamel paint this you know big hobby back in the 60s but anyway these remind me of the the bubblegum cards that i had from that era and now I'm curious to check. I'm going to check online and see if they had have cards relating to other series I had, uh, like Mars Attacks or The Outer Limits or some of those fun things. Anyway, that's the box. Generic brown box. Uh, type box. And these are the cards. They're um, just sort of ordinary playing card stock nothing great don't care much for the backs they're kind of ordinary but this is all about fronts and these are these wacky goofy ugly scary monsters this is one of the jokers here's another one I mean, they're pretty grotesque, but also comical and goofy. I thought you all might get a get a kick out of these. This would have been great to have actually before and leading up to Halloween. Although it's not really Halloween and monsters are monsters year round as is goofy artwork. I 
I think the word I was looking for before was trading cards. Bubblegum trading cards. Which I think started off with baseball cards. And then in the 60s, there were kind of crazy pop images. And I think they even got into, down into... Um, Garbage Pail Kids, which actually was turned into a uh, tarot deck. This also reminds me of Mad Magazine sort of era wackiness. And some of the illustrators or illustrations used in that publication if you collected Mad Magazines, comic books, Monster World kind of magazines from the 60s. These are just so out there, I think these will be popular with many of you. Hope they don't give you nightmares. Oh, these are the protective outer cards. Anyway, thanks for watching with me, and uh, I'll be back again soon with the third of the three decks that I bought, followed by maybe a couple of Marseille decks, because um, I'm circling back to that now. Okay, take care. Till then. Bye.